Hi, Libras. This Hello. is your reading for April of 2020 into May of 2020. And I'm Seth. I'm Faye. And let's see what we got going on for you. Um, okay, as par on course with all the other readings we've been doing today, your finances are picking up, new prosperity energies coming in. But one of the things I'm seeing in here that I've not been seeing in other readings is you're being held hostage to other people's wants, needs, and desires. You are setting yourself on fire to keep other people warm. So you're going to be making some really bad decisions based on other people's needs as opposed to protecting yourself. You've learned this lesson before. It shows this lesson as a reoccurring theme in your life. Uh, you, you, it's almost like the child in elementary school that keeps bringing candy to school so everybody will like them. And you don't have to do that. Uh, there is new energy coming in, new partnerships that are a lot healthier. You've got to let these losers go. I don't know a nice way to put it, but you have surrounded yourself with a bunch of losers and it's time for them to hit the road so you can grow and expand. So basically what I'm getting out of this is that you are in a um, karmic situation. And the thing is, is it's like you've got yourself kind of in this upside down position. So you're very out of tune with yourself right now. And this is because you are learning some very, very important lessons from these people who basically need to exit stage left. Life, okay. But what you've got is a very karmic situation and you are dealing, uh, finishing karmic debts, you know, writing things, however that comes in. Um, the nice thing is, is that you are strong right now. Your strength is in a full uh, position, okay? You're in great shape. Part of what's aiding you right now is that you're taking a break from promotion. You've kind of closed down on an emotional level. And that's a just don't keep it that way forever because that won't behoove you, okay? Um, you're needing some flexibility. Oh. You know, one of the things that you're doing is you are freezing your family out right now. Okay? You're very much freezing out family and maybe friends. It feels like you may have just kind of gone into a complete shutdown right now, which, again, is probably a protection from what's going on around you. But um, it's OK. It feels like what you're doing is you're needing to go in and concentrate on yourself currently. OK. And I think that's okay because the karmic situations that are going on, I think that's part of the lesson for you is to go in and try to get right with yourself, you know, and get yourself back in the upright position. And so, like I say, you've got this massive change going on and it's affecting all of this. So all of this is coming to a head right now. But I think overall, you know, you're in good shape. You know, you, again, you've got your strength upright. You've got your communications are great. You know, you just need to delve into the self some. I agree. I don't see anything else in here. Just to thine own self be true. Agreed. So anyway, uh, if you like what we're doing here, please like, subscribe, ring a little bell. Uh, we are going to be starting to do all our readings over on uh, Crystal Gazer. That's our new channel. So if you do like this, we'd love it if you could come and join us over there and uh, take it away, buddy. And I have started a TikTok account where I'm doing 15 second readings. Uh, it's under Roy S. Tanksley, S. like Seth. Um, and there it's on a daily basis. And if I can get enough followers then I can go live on there and do live readings and you can ask whatever question I can lay them out right then and there. So I would love it if you'd come over there and please subscribe to us and give us some feedback. We love hearing what you think about this. Thank you for joining us. Absolutely. And you guys have a great day. Take care.